colleague here has reported to me that despite the fact that your son impregnated her daughter, he has neglected her and has used every opportunity to taunt her, calling her a cheap girl looking for a rich man's son in the village to marry her. Do you blame my son? He is only 20 years old. I have told Colette this thing several times that my son cannot marry at this age. That she should tell her daughter to leave my son alone. She went into play with such a young boy. Let me tell you, she should bear the consequences of luring my son into sex act at this tender age. Carlo. I understand what you are saying, but there is a way we handle these type of things. Allow your son to marry her, 20 years or not. They will live together and grow together. Special advisor. So you want to advise me, eh? You want to put your mouth into this matter. Go ahead. Go ahead and advise me. Why are you talking to me this way? Am I not the village catechist? Am I not in a position to wade into this matter? Katiki, this is not church matter. What I am saying is that people should not leave the big firewood in their eyes and start removing a tiny speck of dust in other people's eyes you want to advise my son to marry this woman's daughter just because she is pregnant for him is your daughter the baby not pregnant right now in your house has the man that impregnated her come to your house to pay even five cobble on her head look at you you want to advise me you live in a leaking house and you want to teach people how to roof their houses. Unbelievable. life is ruined. Get out of my house. This woman, I say, get out of my house and stop taking all these nonsensical words. Did your husband marry you at 20? No, I can't. I am not going anywhere. Your son must marry her. Your son must marry my daughter. He must marry my daughter. But my child is not that child, but my child is my child. Leave my house. I said, leave my house, you child of this place. You child who makes people to insult me whenever I'm outside this house. If not for God, I will just beat you. Starting this thing without a father before me. I don't call your grandchildren that eh? thing. You have brought nothing but shame to me. I am a catechist. My child should be an example to the entire village. But you are a disgrace. Go! Go and meet the man who pregnated you. I don't want to see you again.
Monsieur, I cannot move outside. People look at me and call me names. Dirt. Go! Go. I want you maybe to take Frank's son to him. He came and lived in the village. And the only way he didn't fit to spend his leave was to impregnate my daughter. She will stay here until you give her money to go and meet your son. Uh -uh. Why are you saying such a thing? Huh? Since he gave birth, has your son brought napkin, baby food, detergent to wash his clothes? Is my daughter football he can keep like that? A football he can keep right inside the bush and leave it there for sun and rain to beat. Anyway, I'm going. Make sure you send this girl to Frank. I don't want to see her in my house again, except if she is visiting with her husband, her son. Papa have gone. Yes, bring your bag and keep it in the room. Hey! Hey! Papa have gone, no! Papa have gone! Hey! Papa have gone and leave me alone in the house of a stranger. Nim, be honest. Is this not wickedness from father to daughter? I'll take care of you. I'll make sure you don't miss your home. Don't worry. I'll take care of you. Good care of you. And then, my grandson. I'll take good care of you. Is this where we are going to be living now? Um, we are going to stay here for a few days. Until I gather transport fare. And then send you to Frank in the city. Hmm? Yeah. I hope you can go very well. Hmm? My son likes good food though. And when you go to the city, you win more of his love with good cooking. <laughs> yes. Mama. Hmm? I know how to cook very, very well. Uh -huh. I really try. I really, really try. I swear. I even know how to do other things that he really like. Uh -huh. uh, what are those things you can do very well? Tell me. I can laugh. Mm. I can cry. I can sleep. I can eat. I can dance. And I can talk very, very well. Mm. <laughs> and even if he wants me at night, I know how to remove my cloth very, very fast. Uh -huh. Yes, and, and I'll make him relax. Mama, <laughs> 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 uh, um, I'm tired. Do you know he's tired? Uh -huh. mm, so let's go and sleep. Let me carry my bag out and go and sleep. Mama, if you want anything, Anything. Come. Don't stress yourself. Come. Mm. Let me carry my bag and go and see.
Madam, didn't you say you were going to Okono Street? This is the end of Okono. Aren't you stopping again? Madam, this is Okono. I am stopping again. See her hair is the local style. Her clothes are old, but she has a beautiful smile. Can act so strange I know she will never change So maybe She means the world to me All the merry girl In the ordinary world She's not a sophisticated lady She's not no big grandma She's so local and so simple But I love her so Do maybe My ordinary girl Sophisticated lady, she know no big grammar. Some people. 
people say she they crazy, but she not know what thing she they do. Do maybe. Madam Foot is ready. Madam Foot is ready. Ah, customer. Good afternoon. Do you have any food there? Because I'm very, very hungry. You can't be hungry when Madam Foot is around. There is food. Yes. Are you my husband's gate man? Eh? I said, are you my husband's gate man? If you are my husband's gate man, go inside and tell him that his wife from the village is here. I want to come inside. My guy's wife? Exactly. Your guy likes me very much. Oh. Your guy likes me too much. Me and your guy, we used to fuck in the village. We used to do it in the roof. We used to do it in the parlor. We used to do it in the bush. We used to do it everywhere, everywhere, anywhere, everywhere, every time, anywhere, all the, everywhere, everywhere. Your guys said I'm the sweetest thing yesterday in this world. The sweetest thing in this world. So your guys to call me sweet mango do my bee. When we used to do it. Eh. You think I used to say no to you? I don't say no to you more. Line for what now? Go for bit. Say no to him for what now? I used to allow him doing any time he do it, any time he likes, anywhere, any time he wants to do, I'll give him to do. Free of charge, no talking, any time, anywhere. Because I love your girl. I love your girl too much. Then, I now got pregnant. Uh, uh, so, go and tell your girl that sweet mango do maybe this year. Oh, yeah, follow me. I will take you inside now. I ask you to follow me. Follow me. Hmm? Uh. You call me ma? Yes. Am I ma? Am I... Have I reached the level of people that call ma? Yes, madam. You're my girl's wife. I have to respect you the way I respect my girl. What oh, is? Can you even sack me from this job? Hey. So I am ma. <laughs> My madam! Hey! Madam too? Yes, ma. And please, don't tell Oga that you told me the way two of you used to do it in the village. Once you get pregnant. <laughs> you know Oga now. You don't like their servants. Knowing their secrets. Please. Hey! Hey! So your servants? Hey! Do me be! <laughs> no, 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 now. Servant is not a bad thing now. Shut up your mouth. Servant is a bad thing. Servant is a very bad thing. Hey! So, I'm going to a servant. Servants are the people that bath on a woman's dog. And they eat the smallest food. A woman can even slap them. I'm missing their mouth and they will not be able to do anything. They told us in the village. They told us. Hey! 
Why do my be? I'm not. I'm not the. I'm not the servant. I'm not the servant. I'm just the gentleman of this house. Hi. To my be. So I've been talking to a servant and they want me from the village. Hey! Uh, servant, carry the bag. Hey! Servant, what? Hey! Maybe? Madame. Madame. Yes, sir. From the village. Madame. Yes, sir. Madame from the village. What are you talking about? What's her name? Uh, uh, My friend, don't be stupid. Uh, I did not ask her her name, sir. But she said he used to call her sweet mango. <laughs> yes, <laughs> sweet mango. <laughs> oh, oh, God have mercy. <laughs> Maybe he's here. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Where is she? Yeah, sorry. Hey, okay, sir. <laughs> Sweet, stupid, scattered, lousy, sugar coated, do maybe, but she's still the best. So, this is both good. News and bad news. Hmm. 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 Look at you. You're still as sexy and as sensual as ever. Hmm. <laughs> I love you. Mm. I love you very, very much. Mm. And I'm happy to see you in this world. <laughs> Do maybe. Eh? <sighs> I like your body. <sighs> you still like it? You still like it in the flesh? <laughs> I like your body. If I stop, I die. <laughs> Do maybe. Go. 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 Come, 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 come. Hey, the cat's but it's still soft. <laughs> <laughs> so we have our baby. We have our baby. <laughs> Come back to this house until you have found him. Are you this silly, stupid? Oh! <gasps> 
Please, did you see my son? Your son? Uh, Do I even know your son? Excuse me. Excuse me. Please, you see my son? He's wearing white polo shirt and he's wrapped in white and blue wrapper. Or oh, did you see any taxi man carrying a son that doesn't look like his own? Eh? Please. Did you see a taxi driver carrying a son that does not look like his own? No, my dear. Maybe you stop passes and ask, or you go to the park. What kind of sleep was I sleeping? What kind of sleep is that? Eh? How could I forget my son in the taxi? What was I thinking of? Oh God! Oh God! Oh! Oh, God. Which way did she go? She, she went to Hey, I've never heard a thing like this before. How can somebody forget a baby in a taxi? Good afternoon, madam. Good afternoon. Please, do you know of any woman who is looking for her missing baby on the street? No, my dear, I don't know of anybody. God. I don't know you. But I just waved at you and you waved back and you were smiling too. So, is it a bad thing to greet somebody? Well, it's not a bad thing. But when you do it with that kind of smile, hmm? it sure does send a message. A message of friendship. Please, can I know you better? Good job. Yeah, I'm looking for my son. You're looking for your son? 
But what do you don't look like you have a son? What happened to him? Forgot him in a taxi. Okay, yes. <laughs> what a joke. Can you be that, please? What are you talking about? This is not a matter of playing. No. My husband sent me out of the house. I should go and look for my son before I step my feet back into the house. This is serious. Please, what happened to you? I don't I don't know if I have sleep in this place. I sleep too much. If I'm sleeping, you can come and carry me. Tiff me. I will not know. Eh? I was inside the taxi. Sleeping. Taxi driver woke me up to drop. I drop. I did my son inside the taxi. Why am I behaving like that? My God. Oh, really, you're such a beautiful girl. I am sex. <laughs> I know. Frank says those words of praise every time. Okay then, see what will happen. Can you come and sleep in my house? Um, since your husband has warned you not to come home until you find your son, maybe tomorrow you will start looking for me again. Yeah? Right. The driver or the taxi driver may be looking for you. I could have put me Go, Dio. Go! I don't know. I don't know what you want. So what did I want? I will not sleep in your house. Lie, lie. Don't okay, make me again. You are, you are like tea. Uh, no, I'm not going to do that. But uh, since you have refused, uh, what are you going to do if you don't find your son? Since you've been warned not to find him until you find your son. I'll sleep here. I'll continue the search tomorrow. You sleep here? Okay, uh, please yourself. At least I have tried. I saw a fine girl on the road who is in trouble. I offered my help and she rejected it. What am I going to do? Kill myself? No, no, no. Don't kill yourself. Don't try. Don't kill yourself. Don't try to. All right. <clears throat> I will be going sugar. How about salt? All right. Mm. Hey, sweetheart, you said you want to sleep here. Yes, now nice. I should not come home, so I have to sleep here. All right. Um. Take care. Okay. You're such a sweetheart. How about Vita? <laughs> you call me sweet, I call you Vita. This is Juju. Please, 
When I was sleeping there, did you see who came and shifted my pint? Eh? Pant? Eh? Papa? Yes. Eh. No, no, no. Somebody came and, and, and climbed me. I mean, did you see who came and climbed me and climbed me there? Come, 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 come. Are, are you joking? She mean you were asleep and somebody came and slept with you and you did not know? I did not know. I don't what know. What kind of sleep was that? Was it sleep or dead? I don't know. Somebody came there and climbed me. Oh. I'm telling you, I can feel it. It's just the evidence. Somebody climbed me. Hi, somebody. Ah, this is bad. Who did that? Sorry. Ah, and the worst part is I cannot find my son. Ah. I cannot find my son. Somebody came and, and climbed me there. Sorry, I don't, I don't know. Hey. Sorry. Ah, they slept with do my pee again. No. Oh. Hey. Come on, climb it there. Hey! They have done it to do maybe again. Hey! Hey! They've done it again. They've cheated to maybe again. Hey! Slept with him again. Again. This child was left in my taxi yesterday by one young woman who dropped off on this street. I don't know the house she entered, let alone knowing anything about her. I've been searching for her since yesterday. Please, do you know or heard of anybody who is looking for her missing son? My God. You mean somebody left a baby in your taxi? What kind of a foolish mother would do a thing like that? Honestly, if I knew, I wouldn't be asking. He's such a cute baby. Such a lovely baby. You know what? I think you should go from one gate to another till you get to the extreme of the streets, okay? I'm sure you will run into her or her house where she lives, okay? All right. Thank you, madam. You're welcome. Thank you. Uh, please, mind the baby. It's still very tender, okay? All right. All right. ABC ABC Sir Sir, sir. Where did Dumebi sleep? Sir, you be your wife? I mean Dumebi, my friend Sir, I don't know She didn't come back yesterday She, she, she went out saying she is going to look for her missing son, sir Hi Now, well, look, 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 look I'm very worried I'm just very worried because this girl has no money for hotel bills she doesn't even have a phone so i can't even reach her huh. she does not even know her way around this city what, what will i do this girl huh. look look if she's not back in the next 30 minutes you go out there and look for her yes sir yes sir did you hear me? Uh, yes, sir. I said 30 minutes and she's not back. Uh, yes, sir. Watch your time. Keep watching it. Okay. You go out there and look for her. Okay, sir. I'll go back. Yes, sir. Ah, Oga. Okay. Where do you find the baby? Are you people looking for a baby in this house? Yes. Oga, okay. where do you find the baby? You people are looking for a baby in this house? Yes. My uh, village wife left uh, his baby boy yesterday in the taxi. Exactly. This baby was left in my car yesterday by a young lady who was sleeping in the back seat. Yeah, come inside, come inside. Come inside. Walk out now. Ah, 
Wait, oh. Mokam is very happy to, <laughs> to see you. Okay. Even chase his wife away. <sighs> he did not even sleep in this house. Thank you. Because of this baby. So go out and go and get the missing baby. Hi. Yeah? You're welcome, sir. Thank you. Hey. Sorry, thank you. <laughs> To know this one, oh, this is not the kind of person you should know. Yeah. We have just arrested him for them. Great. It's a lie. It's lying. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, no, uh, officer, officer, no, 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 don't slap me like that. Don't slap me like that. My husband is a big man in this town. Tell me he raped. I'll call my husband. My husband will bail him. Hmm? Uh, yes. This one, mm. Mm -mm. his cup is full. He just raped a madu man behind the market and he did not know we have been following him based on information we had. And meanwhile, we are still investigating another report from his friend he confided in about a girl he slept with last, last night while she was asleep. Come to think of it, who could possibly sleep with a sleeping woman and she did not wake up while she was being slept with? Anyway, you don't need to think for this one because this one is going to prison and I can you assure you that. Come on, move! Sister, you should help, okay? Come on. Stop. Just Hey! He slept to sleeping woman, and the sleeping woman did not wake up. Hey! That is me, yo. Hey! That is do maybe. Eight. I said it. Somebody tampered with my pants yesterday and shifted it to one side. I knew. I I know it. Ah! Hey! God, I did not catch him, but you caught him for me. He has gotten his reward. Hey! I knew it. Ah! Somebody tampered with you yesterday. I I I knew it. Ah! Do maybe? I felt it. The taxi! Hey! 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 I still don't know how to thank you, you know. For being such a responsible Nigerian. You took your time and traced us to this place and returned this baby. Oh, thank you. Not everybody can do this. Yeah? I want you to know one thing. I am sure that as you toil in life, God will reward you a million times over. <laughs> Thank you, sir. You have already given me 50,000 naira. That is enough reward for me, and I appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, don't hesitate eh? to drop by in my house once in a while. Let's share a drink. Eh? You're now my friend. And when this baby grows up, I will not forget to tell him about this driver. Eh? Thank you, sir. Alright, bye. Bye, sir. Uh -huh. Let me see. Go and open the gate for him. Mm -hmm. yes. And then go in search of the baby. Tell her the baby has been found so she should return. Do that as fast as you can, okay? Yes, Interesting. Junior, I'm not watching. 
Your son has been found. Your son. Your son. The boy. Yes, the boy. Who's the boy? Your son now. My other son. Yes, the boy has been found. Yeah, yeah. My boy. The baby was lost and found, and he has been found. How does my English affect the problem? See, don't treat me like a stupid person because I came from the village to spend my life with you. Mm -mm, don't treat me like a stupid person. In my primary school, elementary primary school, is it okay? No, I used to carry first. Same thing in secondary school, I used to carry first. But and now, after some time, I couldn't do it again, and I stopped going. Before I now met you, he now cornered me into the bush and pushed it inside. <laughs> and I got pregnant and have the baby for me and you. So don't treat me like a stupid person. I know what I'm doing. I'm not foolish. I know what I'm doing. That's not what your father told me. Your father said you were always taken last in your class. And he had to beg teachers to push you to the next level until you stopped at JSS1, not SS1. Uh -huh. If I tell small lie just to cover my face, is he a sin? Is there any girl in this land that does not used to lie? Is he a sin? It's a sin. What's my name? Where did you sleep last night? Outside. Ah! Uh -uh. You want to spoil my reboot, eh? With this your big bomb. Uh. If you want to sit, sit here. This is not a seat, this is a glass. Uh -huh. Where did you sleep last night? Outside. In a hotel. Or outside. Anyway. <coughs> After all said and done, you're still the best. Go. Mm? I prefer you more than all these girls I see in the city. But after go and take your bath uh, and bath the baby, eh? Mm? <laughs> see, see, I'll buy you a phone. I'll buy you new clothes too. Huh? And say after a day or two, let's say tomorrow or next, during lunch break, I'll take you out for lunch. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you're now. Frank's new girl. Oh, life has changed, eh? Push back, push back. I know this one. 
That's the one that by the time you eat it, all your stomach will start going. I see they are shooting gun there. Every minute you'll be going to the toilet. Acham. I didn't say bolognese. I said bolognese. Order it if you want. It's good for it. Yeah. Yes. Mm. Okay. Oh, oh no. Shit. Hey! What is that? Hey! What is that? Calm down, it's just a cop. Calm down, it's just a cop. I'm making this man too much money. I'm not complaining. Hey. No, no, no. I don't want to eat the bolo noise again. Use my money for bolo noise and pay for the cop. Don't worry, I will still buy you the food. Hey. I knew this place was a bad woman. I knew. That's why I told you. In fact, let's go. Let's go and eat Ukwan. I know how to prepare Ukwan very well. What? Let's go. Why are you this silly? Hey! I told you that even if they want a trailer load of cops, I'll buy it for them. Calm down. It's just a cop. Hey! Oh, I'm making you. Hey! No, no, no. It's not good. I knew this place was bad woman. I knew. I know. Now hey! you shut up and stop. This is a public place. Why are you shouting at me? Why are you shouting at me? Because I made the cop! Just because I made the cop! That's why I shot at me! I took my knee!
Oko. You go cause accident too. Child. Oko. That guy will call me seeing the combo. I mean, no sure. Like too Not too much, John. I sleep like small picking that time. Like, you no know, understand. What is it? What? Which way to the right? No, no. Baby, I don't baby, want baby, baby, baby. No! See, looking at you from behind, babe, I love what I see. Tom, boy, stop looking at my bottom. Go away. Stop looking at my bottom. Go away. Yes, 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 girl. Cover it. You see, that is where your problems are. See, your problems are behind you, okay? All your problems are behind. Go! I said go! I will shout. I will shout, though. I will shout, though. See, they're all up here looking at my bottom. Go away. Tell people. Stop looking at my bottom. Go! 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 Yes, ma. Oh, how hard I push your back. Girl, you're the queen out there. You're not seeing me. Yeah. Oh, how good. See, she see how far you can bear it. Damn. No shame. You didn't see the stuff. You're not seeing the bottom of my head. Look here. No shame. Yeah, I'm feeling this shame. Yeah. Wait. Let me go, sir. Let me go, sir. Let me go, sir. Why did you talk like this? Yeah, I'm going to match my back. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Hey. in this place. Is that how you will behave here? Ah. Come boys! They are looking at my bottom! Ah. Come boys! Hey. Look at my bottom! Hey. Oh, my hey. Are you looking at my bottom? No, no.
Senin. Oh, gentlemen and lady, I hope we're on the same page on this. Right. That means I've made myself clear. Huh. Huh. Come on, sir. There's no problem. I'm greeting you saying ah, ah, ah. Um, gentlemen and lady, can we continue this meeting next time? Okay, okay. family. Come, come, come. Come. like this. Don't I give you enough money to buy new dresses? My dear, I'm tired. Let me sit down small. I walk all the way from the house down to your office. No wonder why you are sweating like this. Why didn't you take a bus? I was feeling sleepy. I don't want to carry me the way I don't want to go to. So I said, let me come and trek. Yes, yes. Ah, it's true. You bought me a phone. Ah, yes. Okay, where is the phone? It's at home. Who knows me? Nobody calls me. I bought you a phone so that I could reach you. Yes, the battery ran down. But don't worry, when I go back home, I'll charge it. I'll be holding it. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Uh, anyway, Junior's food is finished. I came to collect money for food. Junior food is finished. The milk is finished. The milk? Yes, the milk you like to drink. You mean the milk? Exactly. So give me money, then we can buy one more. Go, 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 go. 
Gampai has ever turned me on the way that girl does okay. you, you know Dumebi is on cows semi-educated all refined but she is the sexiest panther okay. I've ever seen in the bedroom hmm. but I've learned a lesson all. you know when you see guys that you know handsome guys rich and all that mm -hmm. hanging out with some women that are of lesser class you know women that are not even as pretty as you would have expected the wives of such guys to be mm -hmm. my god don't be amazed you know, you, know, you know some guys that like like hang on to their women as mm -hmm. if their life depends on it as if you know, they can't do without such women. Mm -hmm. You know, following them everywhere. Mm -hmm. My God. Only those guys know what they see mm -hmm. in them. You know? Only those guys know what is sweeting them. <laughs> <laughs> sweeting them in quotes. I am a living witness. My brother. But seriously, I know what you're talking about. Did I tell you about my uncle? No. Who's, like, my uncle is this short. He's one of the shortest people I've ever seen in this world. No, 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 my uncle is not a dog, but he's short. Like, and then he has this big pot belly, and to cry, all he has a ball head. Mm. I swear to God. But go and ask his wife. She will tell you, leave and like that for me. I say, okay. Fine boy, no day for that thing. You know what I'm saying? Mm. She says, fine boy, not for body. Say, fine boy, without asking your nice Scotty B. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Escort, follow me, go party. Follow me, go wedding. Follow me, go bad day. But when she wants to be bought, <laughs> when she wants to be torpedo, she knows where to go to. My uncle. So she says she would rather spend the rest of her days with this man who would rather spend every hour of his in the bedroom trying to please her every way. It's amazing, but seriously, I know what you're talking about. I'm not a stranger to it. I live with him. My uncle is one of them. You know what? Mm -hmm. Only her knows what was his sweet in there. Oh, no, sweet in her there. Absolutely. <laughs> you follow her. Oh, you don't get it. It's okay, it's for me. Man, I, 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 I still have not seen the right word to describe this drug to me. And what is that word? That's the problem, man. I can't find one. One word. You know, Frank, that really seems like a big problem for you. Seriously, like a big emotional problem. What you going to do to Cynthia when she comes back? I mean, Cynthia, your girlfriend, the one we all know. What are you going to do when she comes back from the States? I don't know. That's the question. Honestly, so, I don't know. You're going to send to maybe away? Sweet mango to maybe. Never. 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 Yeah, why? Since I will go. With all her polish, poise, her class, and exposure. No. No, no, no. No, no. no. Never. My guy, you, you, let, let us say that. What I have now is an umpass of the heart. Honestly. You know. Umpass of the heart. That sounds like a movie title. You know. This is just an umpass of the heart. You know.
Don't tell me you're back. <laughs> Hello, darling. Are you surprised? Very surprised. Uh, so, when did you get into this country? This morning. I slept all day knowing you wouldn't be back from work till this evening. As a matter of fact, I am on my way to your house. Are you home? We need to catch up. I missed you. I missed you so much. No. Work. Later. Um, you're not at home. You're at work and you'll call me later. Exactly. Alright, baby. See you later. Mwah. That. I thought you were honest now. And you say, who was that? Not who is that. I told you with my ear, not my eye. Who was that? My friend. She don't like to speak good English. I used to compare my English with. You don't even know for sure. She's a girl. So why did you say she? Frank, you know not allow you to carry on that woman to this house. Because I know my right. My father is a captive. He read plenty, plenty book. And he tell me my right before I come here. So, I will not allow you to carry another woman to this house. Nobody's talking about bringing another woman here. Move aside, let me pass. Uh, Oga? No what is wrong with you? Uh, Listen, your Oga has been avoiding me since yesterday and I don't know why. This is still early morning and I know he has not gone to work. So will you let me pass? Oh, you want to fight with a woman this morning, eh? Because if you dare as much as ruffle this dress I'm wearing, I'm going to lock you up. And this is not my fault now. Oga Frank, they fail to, to see you. And he's confused right now. Why? I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand. Wait, 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 please, please, please. I beg, if you go inside there, I beg. I beg. Tell Ogana you're the person that forced me out of the gate. Please. Or I beg you. Or you force me out of the no my, my, my job. Nobody will start. Eh? America for just two months. 
And I come back to see you comfortably asleep in the arms of another woman. Please do what, Frank. Baby, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So this is the reason you avoided me yesterday? Because she's here. Send you love me. Like I know what you do to not be happy in this world and you die. Send her away. Send her away and I'll forgive you everything. I will not even ask you for details. Cynthia, I would have loved to. But I can't. I just can't send my blood away. Alright then, I'll leave you. Enjoy your village, girl. Cynthia, Cynthia, look, I can send her to the boys' quarters and she will live there. She will never be on her way. She will eat and raise the boy there. And when the boy is grown, I'll send her out, never to come back. You and I have come a long way in this relationship. We've invested a lot to allow an item of loss to come between us. I'm not an item. I'm an item. Where are you going? We still need some bushmeat to service my man around here. Come back! Sidekick! Come and get her things out of my man's room now. When you go, you have your back. Make sure you shower before you enter this house again.
sorry that things worked out this way, okay? You see that lady? She has two master's degrees from the university. And I'm sorry, I know you don't know what that means. But I cannot take you out when I'm hanging out with my friends. You will disgrace me there. At times like this, she's the one I can hang out with. Okay, if my bank is doing end of year's party, I cannot take you there because you don't know table etiquette. You don't know how to eat with fork and knife. And I'm sure that even if I take you there, if you break glass cups, you will shout, Okowano! Before I even know anything. Please, I don't want any trouble. Take me to the quarter, let me put my thing there. I don't want any trouble. But, having said that, you will be well taken care of. You and my son. Look, I, I, things are not as bad as you think. I want you to look at the bright side of things. I could have rejected you and my son and passed you back to the village. But I didn't do it. I accepted you and my son and accommodated you in my house. Who knows? One day you might become Polish and I'll take you out too. I don't, I don't, I don't want. Please, I don't want. I don't know the English. I'll speak now. You say I'm bush. I don't know how to speak English. I don't, I don't want trouble. Take me to the court and let me go and sleep. I'm tired. Come on, sir. I don't know why I look at my brain so. Hey, shut up. Lower your voice. You lower your voice. Look, I'm here to give you some money, okay? For your needs. I don't know what you need. But I want you to have some money in your pocket. Oh. Do you love her? What? Yes. Because you call me sweet mango maybe. Is she sweet mango Cynthia? I know she's not sweet. I know. I know. I think I don't know. I know. I know. What nonsense are you talking about? Frank! How long does it take to give someone money? I'm done. It's already come. I'm not with this house. I will not leave this house. This is my son's father's house. I'm not going to go. I'll be here.
doing here? What are you doing here? What happened to Bitter Leaf Cynthia? Why did you call her that? Bitter Leaf Cynthia? If she's not Bitter Leaf Cynthia, then what are you doing here? Is it not because she's bitter and I'm sweet? Is that not why you're here? Hey, anything you like, say. Hey, I want you to touch me. Hey, hey. Don't you me. 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 Don't you the one that puts on the generator. What are they busy? Is that not his job? I don't understand that boy again. Never took light and he refused to wake up. Never took light. Well, well never light now. Is this not never light? No. Just as I was about to put on the generator, never brought back light. So I had to top off for, for coming inside. That's what I'm trying to say. Frank. Hmm. Frank, where are you coming from? I'm going to put on the generator now. Will I be lying to you? Okay. Where else do you think I'm coming from? Okay. Come to bed. I want to make love. Oh, why not? I like to see you. She's dry. You have eaten everything. My eyes are me too. I'm angry. Oh! Oh! Alice! Alice! Oh! 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 Alice! What is she doing at the gate that a man will pass and he didn't see her? I don't know, Frank. I don't come and show me. Are you coming like this? You need to come with a cane or something. Hey. What is the mad woman? Did you see any mad woman here? Yes. Mad woman? Yes. Where? Where is the mad woman you say you saw? I, I, I thought she was the mad woman. I, 
you need to see the way she appeared at my kitchen. I, I was scared now. Me? You thought she was a mad woman. How? See her now. Look at, look at what she's wearing. Look at her face. Look at, look at her hair. What's the difference between she and all those mad women we see on the streets? Me, I was scared though. I panicked. I had to come and call you. Hey! So this time I'm going to be suffering in my son's father's house? I only can do check if food is ready. You not suck breast yesterday night. You want to suck breast now again? My eyes turning me. I cannot have power to give him breast unless I eat. I came to see if food is ready and I'm not a mad man. My dear, go to the mirror and look at yourself before you talk. Hmm? Look at yourself from head to toe. If you do not see a mad woman, if you do not see a woman who has gone local, come and shit on my pillow. You see? You see? Your sweet mango do maybe has become a mad woman. I thought she had called me stupid girl. But why do you even dress like this? Hmm? Look at the way you're tying up on your shoulder. You've not even taken your bath and you're looking for food. Oh, you want to support her? I didn't say so. You want to support her? I didn't say so. Just warn her. Tell her. On no account of anything I do, shall she call me a mad woman? On no account of all. You see? You started speaking wrong grammar again. Okay. Go with her. Go with her. And when I come, make sure you sleep with her English. Because if you come to my room, I will shout. And she will know what you do every night. Shut up. Are you so loud? Shut up your mouth. Yes, I should give you those food. She said I should pay that. It's enough. You You has grown milk thick and now she wants to bite me. But you know me now. I do not have time to dance in the rain with little children that cannot ditch their private parts. No problem. No trouble. She can reject my food. Though. But what I will not do again in this world is to cook and send to her. She either starves in this house or she opens her own kitchen in that boy's quarter. Are you ready? I'm going to walk. How old is that baby of herself? When is he going to grow so she can leave this house? I don't even blame her. It's you I blame. I don't know why men of these days cannot see a shaking ass and look the other way. Calm down. You're working up a temper. Let me work up a temper. You're going to be in bad mood to face work today. It does not matter. It doesn't matter. What? Why is she even claiming rights in this house? Is it because she has a baby for you? Like I cannot get pregnant and have a baby for you too? Frank. Man, was the challenges of my job. I would have had a baby for you long before she dropped on the horizon. Anybody can get pregnant and have a child. There is no big deal in it. People should just stop blocking my eardrums with Junior this, Junior this. I will not hear anything in this house again because maybe gave birth to Junior. Junior what, Seth? Junior Frank? <laughs> it better not be you. It better not be because my young baby will bear Junior Frank and not the baby of a smelling bush fowl. Not a little dog blues baby. Have you heard that? I'll see you later.
baby. Good afternoon. So, how is the baby today? It's fine. It's sleeping. Oh, I'm fine. I'm on lunch break from the office. So, I came to give him money. You know, cream and baby food. Now, take it. This is 20,000 naira. Hmm? I don't want you to lack anything. Thank you. Cynthia has come to work now. Huh? Let's go to the house. I need you so much. Let me alone. Go to Cynthia. Look, Cynthia is just beautiful, elegant, and polished, but she's dry. You're the one that arouses the man. But she sounds stupid. Everybody sounds stupid. Don't mind her. You're not stupid. Hmm. Intelligent. Hmm. Okay, if you don't want us to do it in the main house, eh? Let's go and do it. No. We'll do it in the main house. In the bedroom. On that bed. It's my right. If you don't want to do it there, then get away. Um, anything you say now, huh? Sit and go. Anything you say. Right. What you are doing is it good? What you are doing is it good? You are living in the main building with her. Me, I'm living in the backyard like a slave. Your son is living like a slave in his father's house. Is it good? Anyway, I want to give me money. Let me go to the market. I'm bought stove and many, many things. I'm cooking by myself here. I don't want to eat Cynthia food anymore. The way my son grow, I'll tell my son to beat her. I don't want to eat her food again. Hey, don't talk like that. I'll talk what I want to talk. I'll talk what I want to talk. See, I'm no longer afraid. I've seen plenty of things in this my life. I've seen something. I've suffered. I'm not going to be here and be eating the small, small food that Cynthia is giving me. No. I said we will not go now. I said we will not go. Follow me. Of course. You know I'll follow you now. Yes. 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 Bleaching body. Bleaching body? That girl is bleaching. Look at him. She's bleaching. Stop that. Just lie down and to remove your clothes. I mean, I'm worried. My lunch break is just for one hour. I just want to do and rush back to the office. If I call you, say ma, or I'll remove my clothes. Say ma, oh. Dumebi is now knowing something. Oh. Dumebi is no longer foolish girl. Frank! Come, 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 come. Please, please. Stop this kind of thing. I told you I'm in a hurry. Just remove your clothes. Lie down and spread your legs. Hurry. Move your hand. Okay. I'll take my left. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, okay. Come. Frank! Ma? <laughs> Frank! I'm going to do my baby bush power. Ma? <laughs> What is the problem? Nothing. You know, you always come back home with work from the office. It gets boring for me. Sitting here alone, watching you work. Not talking to anybody. You don't want me to work? You'd prefer if I was a lazy bum? Of course, I want you to work. But I also want to share my day with you sometimes. You know, like gist and all that. We sit here as if we are in a no talking zone all evening. Then we go to bed and you sleep off before your head hits the pillow. My dear, such is life. I am a career woman. 
just as you are a career man. But you have me weekends, don't you? So if I have something like to share with you, maybe something that happened in the office, you know, some hot gist, you know, to share with you, I will keep it in my mouth and wait till weekend, huh? Every career woman owes herself a duty not to let the man in her life put her in a box. Men like to have control and they get naturally uncomfortable when they do not have that total control over the women in their lives. You are not an exception. But am I going to let that affect the job I have to do? My answer is no. You know what? What? Let me finish. No, no, no. Let me just say that. Let me finish! When I finish, you can say whatever you want to say. That's the problem. You don't ever let any other person talk. You are the wisest woman on earth. Other people's opinions do not count. That's it. I should now allow you talk so you can make useless points. I am no pushover. I am educated. Well educated for that matter. I earn a salary for the job I do. A job I do very well. I am not a woman kept in the house and catered for by any man. I pay my bills. I fend for myself. And I am with you because I want to be with you. You understand that? So, whenever we argue, you must also give me the room to make my own point. So, who hasn't given the other person room now? Me or you? No, no. Who has been talking since? At times, it's good for the woman to keep quiet and listen. Even when the man is talking nonsense, let her keep quiet and make her points later. It's good for her to make the man feel like a man sometimes. Make him feel as if he's winning the argument. No man wants to be with a woman who challenges his points every step of the way. Reserve that for the office. This is a home for Christ's sake. Whatever, whatever. Enough of this distraction. If you want a dondi, a dance, you know where to go now. <laughs> Not far from you, the boy squatters. I don't want a dance. I just want a woman that makes me feel like a man. A woman who even if she knows more than I do, she would talk to me in a manner that would not make me feel in fear. <laughs> Ego. Ego will not kill men of this world. Listen, can I walk now? Enough of this distraction, please. Okay. Good night, then. Meet me in bed when you're down. Meet me in bed. Good night, darling. The old man rejected his balance, insisting that he has one million naira in that account. So why should we give him three hundred thousand naira as balance? Hmm. Hmm. <sighs> we were thinking, oh, we were thinking of that day. This is what happened in the office today, today. Oh. <laughs> so that day, today, he came with his son to withdraw hundred thousand naira. Sign your signature now. He signed. Shake, 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 shake. shake. Ah, they informed me as the bank manager. So I now told the old man, why can't you get a signature to the account? You know what signature means? It means a person that can sign and withdraw money on behalf of the owner of the account. Mm -hmm. So the old man said, okay. He wrote a letter. They brought the letter. Sign the letter now problem he wanted to sign the letter <laughs> so the the, the 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 grandson was like hey i can help my father and sign the signature now i said how are you sure you can get the signature he said because i've been using it now to withdraw money from the account i signed the signature and withdraw. <laughs> <laughs> the cook that has been withdrawing money most money like that. we arrested him there and then <laughs> don't catch him 
Go just catch him like that. Sit man, go. Sit man, go. Sit man, go to baby. Hmm? You're fine these days. Go. <laughs> Let me go and change my. Do you want to go now? Do you want to go so that Peter leaves since I will not come here and catch you laughing with us? No, now this is my office dress. I want to change now to so I can be free. You know, to wear normal dress now. Can buy the money for stove and food stuff. Okay, I'll send it to you later in the night, eh? Or tomorrow's morning. Tomorrow is Saturday now, so you can go to the market tomorrow. Okay. Eh? Okay. Hmm? Go. <laughs> go. <laughs> Than me because you went to your university. Let's fight now. <laughs> Let's fight now. Let's fight. Let's fight. Oh my god, you are so hilarious. What in the devil's name is your university? <laughs> Do as she said and go to the boys' quarters. I'll send a BC to get you whatever it is you need. Here is not meant for you, okay? That's what I'm going to say. That's what I'm going to say. You don't say that wicked word to me, just to please our be. Shut up and do as I say. You will close your mouth! Close your mouth too! Let me talk! Let me talk too! I know you can't speak your English in your world. I know you know how to do English in your world. Isn't my fault? Isn't my fault that 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 just as one six times? Eh? Let me tell you. That's the level I get to before the books are like confusing my brain. If you don't know, ask anybody. That's what I will tell you. What do you mean? Eh? Why is she laughing at me? Why is she laughing at me? Why are you making fun of me? Eh? When she's not there, you come, lunch break, one hour, one hour, one hour, one hour. You not let me rest until you sleep with me. But when she's there, you behave as if I'm smelling. It's not bad sense. It's not bad sense. I'm not going to take my child and I'm not going to leave your house. If you don't have any way to sleep, we'll get on you out! Stop. We get man! Can't. This is I think she's in the room. Hey! Just hold it there. You know what? I'm leaving you too. Because you're such a confused man. You don't even know what you want. <laughs> Call me when you decide who you want to be with. Polished Cynthia. Or dirty, smelling, bush, stupid Dumibi. I'll get my back. But she has a beautiful smile She really can act so strange I know she will never change So maybe she means the world to me Ordinary girl In an ordinary world She's not the sophisticated thing She not no big drama She's so uh, Hello, where are you going to? Can I? Can I give you a ride? Well, you shouldn't be on the road with your baby like this. Huh? We'll give you a ride.
going to do what you are doing. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Don't tell me sorry. Don't have accident too. Somebody's house. What? Who? Whose house? Do maybe? It's the man that I was yesterday. I was carrying Junior. I went to cross the road. I was almost crying. The man that brought us to his house and gave us a place to sleep. Now I'm drinking juice. Oh my God! You're in a stranger's house. What if he rapes you? Are you stupid or what? Leave that house and come back now as I'm talking. Don't command me. Don't command me. Eh? I will command you all I want. You're my wife! I'm not your wife. I look at my diary. My bride price. I left your house since yesterday night. See the time you're calling me. This morning. Shut up! Is that what you're talking? Is that what you're saying? You know what? Go to hell. Don't even come back. Look, if I see you in my house again, I will push you out. Oh, thanks. Well, I... I heard you yelling on the phone. All is well. Oh, oh good. Okay. Uh, Can you drop us at home now? Okay. Let's, let's go. Thank you. But you give me your number, then I'll give you my own. <laughs> okay. Let's go. You join me in the city. Yeah. Okay. Cynthia, you've always been my love. Darling, please forgive me. You know, I'm a man now. The temptation was just too much for me. Please, please, please. I Please, I beg you, come back. Come back. Yeah, I promise to be a better man. Yeah.
friends, I'm surprised. Mm. Oh my God. Look, I promise I will never do such a thing again. You promise? I swear. You know? <laughs> Hey! Hey! After you have come to beg me, I've come back now and I'm still with her. She's still here. Frank, what is the meaning of this rubbish? So you haven't put a stop to this? You brought me here to embarrass me? You have to put a stop to this rubbish that is going now. You have to, you have to put a stop to it. I'm going. I'm going back to that man's house. That man that buy me juice. I'm going back there. When you decide who you want to marry out of the educated girl and the foolish village girl, call my number. Don't touch my box, don't touch my box. You cannot go back to the man that is going to know. You cannot go back to the man that is going to know. And you? What are you doing here? What are you doing? My friend, get out. Beautiful, beautiful woman. <laughs> you see, um, the last time you were here, I didn't give you money. And that's not good enough. So, um, <laughs> here, just a hundred thousand naira. Put in your purse. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> here, you see this money? I'm giving you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, no strings. You know, and that's because you deserve the best from any man. <laughs> Come on, take it. Me? Yes. You. Who? Who else are we talking about? You're not just the two of us in this house. I couldn't have been talking about someone else. You, of course. Come on, take it. <laughs> You're welcome. You're welcome. Huh? Uh, you see, your beauty intoxicates me. <laughs> uh, and like I always say, you know, um, there'll be anything you think I can do for you to make your stay perfectly wonderful, fantastic. I will do it. Just say it and I will do it. Okay? <laughs> yes, um, um, let me sort out the visitor's room again. Okay? Uh, or you want to sleep in my room this time? No, yeah, I'll sleep in the beast room where baby is. Okay. It's okay. <laughs> Just one second. Huh? One second. <laughs> my beautiful woman. Uh, one second. <laughs> oh, fine, beautiful girl. Do men do everything I want them to do? Why do they look at me like that? I'm not easy to do. I don't know how to speak English. I don't even know how to use fucking knife. Why do they look at me like that? Even Papa in the village. Papa used to call me foolish do maybe. Everybody in the village to call me stupid Jumebi. But in this city, all the guys I've seen want to be with me. Even though I have Junior. It means that I have power over them. My body. <laughs> they, they want my body. Hey, bad men. It means that there's power in my body. There's 
power in the body of a foolish village girl to control all the city men. My body, now that I have discovered that they want my body, hey, I know what I'll do. Men, they have allowed me to know something I did not supposed to know. They allowed me to know something I did not supposed to know. Hey, bad men, bad men, they want my body. All of them bad men. Bad bad men. Bad men. I should sit. I should sit. I see their eye. Their eyes like teeth. All of them in this city. Their eyes like teeth. What's okay. eye? They're looking at you. Oh my gosh. You know what I'll do? Now that all of them want my body, I'm going to. Buy a new car. I'll buy a new car and take it to the village so Papa will not more stupid. My mom foolish. I'm smart, do my be. Why is do my be? Absence. All of them thief. City men. Thief. Thief. <laughs> do my be the foolish girl. I've become do my be the smart girl. Do my be. Yeah, please come back home now. It's been two days now since you left home. Yeah? Come back home, or at least tell me where you are. If I tell you where I am, what are you going to do? Are you going to come here and force me on your head and take me home? Or are you going to tie me rope and take me to your house? No, no more. Eh? I will at least come to you and beg you for forgiveness. Eh? and convince you to return home. This is your home now. Sweet mango to me be. I call Gazem. Tell me, where are you? I don't know where I am. Okay, okay, okay. That man that is harboring you, is he there with you? He's not here. He has gone to business. Eh, do some. Sweet mango. Tell me now, where are you? Let me go and get the gate man phone, let the gate man tell you where it is. Hey, hey. Huh? I'll go and I'll be waiting, eh? No small place, though, it's big. Maybe it's a boy quarter. So, so, this is where you stay, eh? Yes. Uh, where's Junior? He's sleeping in the house. The main house, oh. Not the boys' quarters. We have our own room in the main house. We are staying in a good house. The owner is a good man. He never touched me. He's been so good to me. He said if I want to marry him, he will pay my bride price today to day. God today. forbid. God forbid. Pay whose bride price? Is that possible? You already really married. Since I've been in your house, have you asked me if you can take one bottle of whiskey and go and pay my father for bad price on my head? Have you asked me? Because you get me for free. You play me like football. You play me to the backyard of your house. Eh? I'm not must with my bill. I'm now wise. I'm not your wife. So who taught you all this? That man? His name is not that man. His name is Mr. Jim. He did not teach me anything, no. I learned something by thinking to myself when I was in your boys' quarters with my son suffering. You are being inside AC, enjoying with Bitterleaf Cynthia. Okay, now that Bitterleaf Cynthia is gone, just go inside and collect all your things. Let's go home. Eh, eh, I cannot. I will wait until Mr. Jim come back. You want me to pay good thing with bad thing? No, I have to wait for Mr. Jim to come back. I will tell him. If he says I should follow you, then I will follow you. 
Meaning that you need his permission to return to me? Yes. Because I tell him everything that you have done to me. I tell him, he's very angry. Mr. Jim said you are, you are taking advantages of me. Yes. Advantages. You are taking advantages of me. That's what you are doing. And he's saying I should not allow somebody to treat me like a nobody. Because I am a somebody. A very beautiful somebody. A somebody that will take my rightful position in a home. Yes. That's what he said to me. Mr. Jim, I've opened my eye. I'm my wife. Now I've opened. See, I will carry you now. And I swear, by weekend, I will take you to the village and carry out the marriage introduction between you and I. What? What? Why me? Why me? Oh, so you cannot take me to your company and a beer party. You can take bitter leaf, Cynthia. To me be sweet potato. I have employed a private teacher to teach you. And I know you will learn because you're smart. That's because I love you. You're the one I truly love. I want to be with her. Eh? That one is for sure. Show the last. That one don't go. It's you I want to be with. Eh? Sweet do me. Go, go, go to your house. Go to your house. Go, go come in mango. I'm on your mango. Go come in mango. Go to your house. When Mr. Jim come, I'll discuss with Mr. Jim and then we'll call you. Come, 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 come. Hey, no, no, no. See, see, out. This time, eh? You are my queen. Eh? African queen. Sweet mango. Don't call me mango. I'm not your mango. I'm not your mango. Go. When Mr. Jim come, I'll discuss with him and then I'll call you back. Go to your house. want to say thank you and to say that you are a gentleman and when you took care of this lady and our baby without any attempt at violating her you know this speaks volume of your personality and I appreciate it. thank you <laughs> excuse me I'm not going with you. I'm marrying you. You're not serious. I found somebody who loves me as I am. Bush, bad English. You like me like that. And he's going to punish me with time. Stop talking nonsense. Is it all the same thing that I promised to do? You, you force yourself. He did not force himself. His own is natural. You like me the way I am. And you, you like to sleep with me like I am. And then you push me out to save yourself from my shame. You push us inside those quarters. Do you remember? Me and my son, we eat sardine and bread. We see disgrace in your house. Now, we have a home. I'm going to stay here because he wants to pay my bride price. When my son grew up, if you want to carry him, come and carry him. But for now, Jim will be his father. Yeah. And if you wish to contest that in a competent court of law, we will be very happy to face you. Oh, Mr. Jim, you're a gentleman, and it does not come to this. Please, don't no, do no, this. No, no. Don't Jim. It's not a decision, no. It's my decision. Oh. I like the way you love me. It does not to hide it. You used to hide your own, because you're ashamed of me. Two weeks now, me and you are going to go to the village. You don't pay my bride price. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. Very soon, you find on that girl. But if you find on that girl, show her love. Show her love, though. No matter what anybody is going to say, show her love. Mm -hmm. Yeah? 
Thinking of what we will say. Stupid man like me. I was too bothered with rubbish things that do not even matter. What is eating with my mind? What is speaking too much ground? I should have put time in school myself. I was carried away by Kalewu. Okay, see me now and see Kalewu now. Another man has taken the music out of my hand. I've lost the movie. Eh? I've lost the movie. I've lost everything. I've lost. Well, well, well. <laughs> did you, did you ever think that I was going to take your wife? Did you ever think that I was going to leave you? Well, to maybe he actually begged me to help her to play the role uh, of teaching you a lesson. A moral lesson about how to value what you have. Well, I'm sure that by now you've learned your lessons. And so I'd suggest that you pay her bright price as quickly as possible. Because there are so many men out there, indeed plenty of them, waiting to have what you are neglecting. But she not know it. 